I made chicken fajitas and salsa verde. I have both recipes recorded and I will leave the links below. They are both very, very good. I made Mexican lasagna and cilantro lime rice. I have recipes for both of them and I'll link them below. This time I made the Mexican lasagna in the oven, which is very easy to do. I just wasn't here to put it in the slow cooker. But if you want to make it in the oven, just do it the same way as you would in the slow cooker in a 13 by 9 dish and bake it at 375 degrees for about 30 minutes until it's heated through and the cheese is melted. I have some hot food here so I can't get too close but I made red beans and rice with chicken and dewy sausage and I served it over brown rice. This is really really good. It's a little bit spicy so if you like spicy food this is a winner. I do have the recipe recorded so I will put the link below. Tonight I made my lentil soup. This is very easy to make and it's just simple flavors but it's delicious. It's very hot so it's steaming up the camera lens. I have gotten some really good feedback from this recipe so if you haven't tried it I'll leave a link for it below. Sorry for the seam on my lens. I also made a big salad. It's just romaine lettuce, cucumber, tomato, and some carrots. And then I made some homemade Catalina dressing. This recipe isn't mine, but I will leave the link below. Today I made my shredded pork tacos. I make the pork in the slow cooker, and I do have the recipe recorded, so I will put the link below and then I made cilantro lime rice I have a recipe video for that as well and then we are having some pinto beans and have cilantro on everything I made homemade minestrone soup which is one of my favorites I recorded this recipe quite a while ago so I will link it below and I normally make focaccia bread with it sorry it's seaming up the lens again I normally make focaccia bread with my minestrone soup and I'll link the recipe for that below but we were out and I didn't have time to make it when I got home so I had some leftover hamburger buns that I actually wanted to use up so I just brushed them with some melted butter and then sprinkled garlic and oregano on them and then baked them until they were crispy. Tonight I made pasta carbonara. I have my recipe recorded. This is not authentic, but it is very, very good. It's one of our family favorites. And then I just made a very simple Caesar salad. So I just have romaine, shredded Parmesan, and we really like the Romana Caesar dressing from Trader Joe's. The simply dressed Caesar dressing, which is in the refrigerated section, in most grocery stores is also a really good Caesar dressing.